it's Monday today and it's gonna be a super busy week this week. Christmas time is coming, so that's always the busiest time for me. <laughs> Many people probably. But I've got some private commissions to do this week. I've got Christmas cards to do that's quite urgent because it takes two weeks to get them done. And on December 4th, I'm gonna be selling them at the Christmas market in Suho House that the shop where I work at, Suk, is uh, hosting. So I'm super excited for that, but I need to really hurry with them. So I'm gonna show you how that's going. Also some fun stuff, hopefully this week. <laughs> Edi, kje si ti barava? A bi govorila na slovensko? Ja. Let me try. Ja, no fuck, najhujši ljubi v lajfu. Res, 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 cards and I'll show you the update on what I've done so far and what I have for sketches. I want to do at least four all together. So this one I'm already happy with. It's very similar to the Berlin postcard that I did a few weeks ago. And then I have this one. This little bear is coming home for Christmas. And then for the sketches, I have something like this. I want to make a destruction kit. <laughs> so um, there might be like a Christmas tree in the background. Can you see there's a lowered opacity there? Um, I'm still working on it, so this might change still. And then I want to do something like this also. Chocolate around his mouth. Oh, this was the... Um, the sketch I did with colors already. Something like this. Okay, so the private commission is again from Sabine, my most loyal customer of the private commissions. So she asked me to draw a poster of her and her friends as a gift for one of her friends in a style of the Berlin People posters and these postcards that I also got re printed recently. These are A5 postcards of all the Berlin areas that are also on the prints that I showed you in my last video. So she wants an illustration looking like this, but just featuring her friend. So I thought it was a really cool idea. And she sent me pictures of all the ladies. And I sketched them all here. and all their hobbies. 
things they do. So today I need to ink all these and then color them and put them in a composition. And also she might order the postcards as well. Um, and also I haven't shown you here on a proper video these postcards. These are also the Berlin postcards I drew in recent videos. They're from Moo.com. They are already for sale in the shop where I work at on Insuk. And um, soon maybe some other places and also online. I'll let you know when that happens. I only ate one tub. <laughs> one tub? Yes. Mm. Miss me on that. <laughs> I'm taking care of all my winter stuff. Steaming a little bit because it's suddenly going super cold outside. Look at this guy. It's a long duck scarf. It's from Donna Wilson, where I did my internship. And I had it since a few years before I had Eddie, so. <laughs> Another late night <laughs> but now I'm done with all the stuff that was necessary for me to finish this week so at work I finished the private commission it's like my Berlin posters but for a private commission so there are all these ladies um, their friends and this one in the middle with the angel wings she um, is celebrating her birthday and her friends ordered this for her so that sent off the print and then also the Christmas cards I just uploaded to Moo. I put, I put all the designs up here on the screen for you so you can see them better. Also there was a weird thing like on Moo normally you can completely customize all of the cards. When I order postcards you can completely customize the front and then also the back where the information is and the lines to write the address and stuff. But for some reason on the greeting cards, there wasn't that option to completely customize the back of the card. So there was like a little square where you could put your logo and then lines where you can add some text. So I designed the back already and I liked it and then I went to upload and it didn't work. So I got really frustrated. And uh, then just typing the text in the middle of the page didn't look right. 
and then I decided to draw this logo and handwrite the text. And now the bags look like this. Would you think it's nice? So this is for the horizontal one. It's like this. And then the vertical ones. I'll just show you here also. So this is the front of the first one, the front of the second one, front of the third. Insides are empty. And then on the back, we have this one again. Now I can just breathe a little bit now that everything is going to print. Everything is supposed to come back in time. Tomorrow, tomorrow some exciting stuff uh, happening. Very unexpectedly, I'm going to be part of a little exhibition in early December here in Berlin. Uh, <laughs> which is quite exciting with the prints, the Berlin prints. So tomorrow I'm going to meet the organizer and the lady who is also exhibiting. I'll tell you all about it once I know everything. <laughs> to keep Eddie undercover. <laughs> we get a bollocking every time, but <laughs> he doesn't want to stay home. <laughs> so, yeah, that is delicious. Delicious plant bullet. <laughs> then we're gonna buy some stuff for the apartment that's still missing. It's always funny. You play a fire rabbit. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good. That wasn't too bad. No. It's quite amazing, huh? And in this, they're safe. It's a premium product, yeah. My God, yeah. <laughs> and then you packaging. It's been coming now like for the whole week, package by package, item by item. Okay, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I'm happy to have a weekend off now. <laughs> well, <laughs> after editing this video for you. So, um, thanks for watching and see you next Sunday. See ya. Where are my friends? They There. <laughs>